Live and direct from the 213. To the 909. Yes, like that. Today we got a special reaction video for you guys, all right? Yes. Today we're going to be reacting to Rap Man's Letter to Cadet. Mm -hmm. All right, this is a tribute video. Yes, continuing. To we know that um, they had a close relationship. Uh, I mean, yeah. The music, it yeah. was a uh, music video. Yeah. yeah, all that. So. Shut I knew he was going to come up. I knew he was going to come out with one, all right? So we're going to do oh, it. Oh, you did? You had a feeling Yeah, was. I knew it. Mm -hmm. I knew it, all right? Uh, if you're not a part of that farm, hit that subscribe button one time so you can join it. Let's get into the joint. There has to be a way I have to get involved in this. I have to. And plus, with me and Rap Man here, they love seeing us come together. They've wanted us come together for so long. So, as such, it's just, it just has to happen. It has to happen. Uh, me and Rap Man actually haven't worked in the past before, you know. But it's always. That's one thing I can say about Cadet. Even though I didn't know him, always smiling. Always happy. From ear to ear. Always. The biggest smile. And they just always could put a smile on your face. Mm hmm. Yeah. He didn't have any kids, huh? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. In the air, like anyone you ask about Cadet's music or Ratman's music, I'm sure you get to it as much as I do. Every time I hear Cadet, hey, listen, you used to do a tune with Ratman, you can tune with Ratman non stop. Even under the comments on my videos, it's all work with Ratman. So it's just, it just has to happen, and I'm, and I'm so glad it's starting to happen now. But hopefully, there's a lot more coming. Man can't believe man's doing this, brother. Man just spoke to you last week. Mud. Yo, your cadet cards, what's good, blood? How's it getting up there? Yeah, you died too young and you died too soon. For real, man, it really weren't fair. I was with you that Wednesday before you passed, and there was such a great vibe in the air. Spoke about music, spoke about progress, spoke about everything regarding careers. And you said you never been to the States, and how you really wanna go someday. Wanna know what it's like, said it looks tight, said you need a man there to show you the way. Spoke about labels, said they never hollered. I was like, fuck them pricks anyway, cause you done charted all by yourself. All they're gonna do is just stand in your way, you don't need them. Bear blessings your way, just receive them. You put in work from day, that's the reason. Bar after bar in the car, cause we fiend them. Yeah, we need them. Now that you're gone, the challenge thing's long. Hey. The cadet had the most fire freestyles, like the oh Instagram little joints that he used to throw out. Oh my, and then the buff man. The like, first one that I heard cadet do, I can't even remember, dude. It was so It many. was before advice, though. Yeah, yeah, it was way before advice. Yeah, before. yeah that dude is freaking dope, dude. Cause everybody knows you was the best at that And any single time you would jump on the beat You would always pour out your heart on the track And when I first saw you behind bars I was like damn I need to level like that Find a way that you broke that down Right then and there I had to take off my hat And I said all of this to your face I always show love when it's someone I break So you know cause we come from an industry Where certain man can't help but to hate Kept me on my toes Small rivalry but we turned into bros Without you in the game God knows Never rapped about drugs Never rapped about roles Still got the kids gas That alone their shows you was one of a kind, the fact that you're gone cause it plays in my mind Wasn't like we were best friends but there was a special respect that's a rare thing to find When we first came out they tried to play us against each other, you get me? Tried to make us rivals, you get me? They would dish you in my- Yeah, it's crazy because like, when, like you know Ratman is like a storyteller, right? Mm -hmm. And then when we first heard Cadets, um, what was the joint? Closure. I was like, damn, he reminded me of, of Ratman. The storyteller. Yeah, and Ratman was saying like when they first like when they Linked were up. coming up, no, when they were coming up, people were trying to put them against each other because they were kind of in the mm -hmm. same lane, but not really. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But why go against each other when you can work together? You know what I'm saying? That's what we're saying right about, now. Um, even though I know this is not related, but Cardi B and Nicki. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like you don't have to go against each other. No. Y'all both killing it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Get each other, you get me? Got to make us rivals. You get me? They would dish you in my videos and diss me in yours. But when we met, it was all love. I remember when we first met, 2016 SB event. I was like, yo, there's my enemy cadet. You was on stage, you were shelling down the set. Came on stage, smiled and you spotted me. Small little hug, if you think it was lovely. Took a picture and exchanged numbers. Then we spoke on the phone next day. We agreed that when the time's right, we'll jump on the track and blow everyone away. Yeah, I remember speaking to you about on WhatsApp the next day, man. That we both agreed that when we work together, it's gotta be something 
epic, you get me? Because people have wanted it for so long. Fast forward to Sharon's story. I'm talking right at the end of part two. When they heard your voice and they saw your face, they went mad because people they knew. It's like the only thing that could gas it up more is if the thing involved you. So I appreciate all the time you made and I'm thankful that you came through. It's like you acted dope and you wrapped it dope. It's like everything turned out nice. And in part three, in between takes you and Dino, you made advice. And that tune you made in like an hour break, who wouldn't. Him and Dino made advice during a break. During the break on the set, babe. That's crazy. This is dope. Between takes you and Dino, you made advice. And that tune you made in like an hour break, who would have known it would have changed your life? You deserve to try and you deserve the fame, but fam, you didn't deserve to die. Nah, fam, you didn't deserve to die, cause 28. What type of age is that, brother? You should have lived into your great ages, fam. Fam, it was the hardest worker in the game, real talk, bro. I'll be real. I remember telling you, fam, you know. This shower story is gonna take hours and you that raps. I'm not afraid of hard work, you know. <laughs> the way you shut me down, bro. Oh, cadet, my guy, fam. You made me up my game. I'll be real, man. See your behind bars about your pops? Best behind bars I've ever heard in my life, and that's no joke. I don't think it's ever gonna get tops. And I said this to you. I'm so glad I said this to you. Like, and this ain't no clout thing, no clout chasing thing or nothing. This is a respect thing. I had to make the song out of respect. Without you, I would have never have tried to up it. So thank you for coming into this lane and making people appreciate the art of narration, storytelling, whatever you want to call it, the type of rap that only a few of us made. And you definitely, definitely was the best. R.I.P. bro, man. Gone but never forgotten. I knew that was gonna be dope because rapping is a good storyteller mm -hmm. anyway and like when he's rapping he's kind of it's like he's talking you yeah. know what I'm saying yeah and you can understand it you know what I'm saying um yeah the joint the joint looks tight yeah the joint looks tight you're right over there yeah it, this is really it's hard. hard it's hard it's been hard to film these yeah you know but uh yeah it's just crazy how uh how rap man admitted like cadet just made him better like yeah. and how at one point like you were saying like people were trying to pin them against each other mm -hmm. which i didn't know that like i mean i knew that they both kind of it's, comp it's competition you know what i mean but um you know, friendly you yeah. know competition or whatever mm -hmm. but um he really and he i'm i mean i'm not saying Sharo's story wouldn't have been great Without him, yeah, but when we saw, it. <laughs> but with it really added, yeah. like it, it really added a different element to mm -hmm. it. I mean, and then like his acting, like mm -hmm. I was, yeah, it was on point. It was believable. It was so believable. It was believable. Yeah, um, it was too good. Like, dang, like he really took this serious. But this is why we're doing this. This is why we kind of rolled over into another week, mm -hmm. you know, for tribute week because it's like, like, I, like we said, or I said in the beginning, you know, we both feel this way though. Mm -hmm. Um, we wanted just to dedicate a few more, you know, just really just to like live on his legacy. And even though I know we're not going to be reacting to every song he's ever made or anything like that. But it's like these videos, these few videos that we are going to be reacting to this week, um, really just, you know, just to showcase just really his talent and just how, um, you know, he was an underrated legend. Mm -hmm. You notice how every video clip on there smiles. <sighs> From ear to ear. Yeah, I'm sure it wasn't hard trying to find a video with Cadet smiling, you know? It's heartbreaking. All right, that was our reaction. Hope you guys enjoyed it, all right? Yes. If you're not a part of that bomb, hit that subscribe button one time so you can join it. <coughs> Until next video, guys, deuces. Like that.